Hello, teacher. Hello, Zeke. What happened? You seem worried. I have lost my watch in the jungle when I was playing with my friends. That was a gift from my father and it was precious. I am afraid that my father will be so mad at me. Look, Zeke, don't be worried. Look for it where you were playing. I looked everywhere, sir, but couldn't find it. I think it was fallen in the lake, where it is impossible to take out. Hey, Zeke, please don't cry. Tell me how can I help you in this situation. I can talk to your father, if you say, about this incident. My father will not believe me if I tell him the truth. I must tell him that the watch was at home and I did not bring it here. I will act like I am totally unaware of it, or I will tell him that I gave it to my mother. She is so forgetful so I will be saved and all the matter will be on my mom's shoulders. By this he will not be mad at me at least. That's so good idea, I am Genuese. What? That's very bad of you. You won't just tell a lie but also put your parents into a fight. You must be ashamed of this thought. Just tell your father whatever is the truth. Telling lies is bad. Just keep it in your mind. By telling a lie you will learn nothing but to be sinful in the eyes of God. And also you will be a source of misunderstanding between your parents. Remember, telling the truth may be difficult for one time but it will bring no harm in future. But if you tell a lie you will have to keep telling more lies just to justify your fear at lie. Hope you understand. You are right sir, you have opened my eyes. I will never tell lies to anyone. I will say sorry to my father and tell him the truth. Thank you very much for saving me from committing a sin. That's very nice of you. I am sure your father will not snub you and also get you a new watch. Now go home it's getting late. Take care and goodbye. Thank you sir. Take care. Bye.